Hey, how's it going everybody, man? Welcome back to another episode of FTV Fishing, man. Today, man, I got another, uh, got another real review for you guys. I think you're gonna like it. I got the new, well, not really new, new, new to me, but, uh, this has been out for, a, you know, honestly, I don't know. Well, uh, it's, it, this has been out for a while, this reel has, uh, but this is the, the Vanguard 2500 series, the, the high gear. And man, I'm here to give you another reel review. This reel right here, I have used this. Uh, I got this probably four or five days ago, and I've used it three times. Um, and I'm just now doing the, the, the review on it. I actually, I wanted to try it out first because, like the other reviews I did, I got the reel, did the review, and then and then went fishing with it instead of going fishing with it and then doing the review. You know what I'm saying? So now I'm kind of switching it back up. So. Hopefully y'all enjoy that. Um, it has been a minute since I posted any videos, but you know, just working and whatnot. But I'm here for another, I'm here, man. Still got it, still getting it. Trying to anyway, but let's get into it, man. This bad boy right here is awesome, dude. Let me tell you, man. Is it, you hear that? You, do you hear it? It's, I can't believe it ain't butter. That's what that is right there. Can't even believe it, dude. This is really, really smooth. What's the other reel I got? I just got the the Nasky, uh, not too long ago, probably like two months ago, and that reel was pretty. That reel was good. Uh, you can look up on the, my my other videos. I can post it down there in the link below, so you can uh, watch that video. But this bad boy, this is, might be one of my new favorite uh, spinning reels, honestly. Uh, this right here is the carbon body. Uh, it has a carbon body frame, which makes it really, uh, really light. Which actually it weighs about six point three ounces. Um, the other, the other ones, I'm not really too sure of the other weights of the uh, other reels, but that's irrelevant. The, it has a cross carbon drag system. Uh, the max, the max, uh, the max weight or the max the max drag is 20 pounds so this thing can this can haul in a it can haul in a beast i'm telling you uh it has the click drag uh click dragging system so it's going to click when you uh when you're having you know when your drag gets pulled out it has a uh seven right here let's look it has seven to one or seven plus one uh ball bearings it has a deeper cut spool, which uh, which holds which holds more. It's able to hold more more line, basically. I'm just trying to read off these little notes I got right here, man. <laughs> hey, man, this reel is really awesome, man. Just look at the. I want to give you just a little look on what that on what that bad boy looks like. This is really. I like the I like the color of it. That red and black, that red and black detail on it. I'm definitely, definitely liking that. I'm just giving you a little quick 360 view of it. Trying not to get my ugly face in the way. Yes, sir. This is it. This bad boy right here. I'm already in love with this thing. It is a little pricey. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie. I believe you can find this. Uh, I got this. What's the date? Uh... What's the date? The June 26th. So I got this probably, I got this last week sometime, and it was about 230, 30 good ones. But, but, I do believe that is worth it, man. It has a few, a few really big details that uh, se separates this thing from a lot of reels, man. It has the carbon cross, uh, or the carbon fiber uh, body, so it that that makes it really really light. Which this right here, this one weighs about six point three ounces, I believe. Let's go to the box. Uh, yep, it says right there six point six point three ounces. The maximum drag on this bad boy is twenty pounds. So you you can haul in you haul in some big ones, some big girls. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Not the ones down there from Hot Legs either. <laughs> and then also it has a. Uh, six uh six to one gear ratio so this thing uh this thing you know what i'm saying it's a this is a a unit i'd say that i believe that it's worth every 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 penny of it 
But let's go into a little bit further detail on this. Uh, it has the deeper cut spool, uh, which I have the line on here. It holds a little bit more line. And this holds about 200, 200 yards of like six pound test line or 140 yards of eight pound test or 120 yards of 10 pound test line. And uh, you know you can you can honestly put whatever whatever line you want to on here. I mean, fishing has no there's no rules or anything. These are just like minor small guidelines, um, if I had to say. But you can do whatever you want on here. You can put a <laughs> yeah, I was about to say something, but you can put whatever you want on here. You know. But uh, anyway, the also the handle is interchangeable, so it has a little knob right here on the side which connects to your your cranking handle, and you could take this off. And uh, you can switch sides, so it, I'm, I'm not gonna do that right now, hold on. So you just unscrew this. Unscrew that bad boy, uh oh, there we go. Uh, actually, while I was talking while I was spinning, the, uh, this is also made with the, uh, the MGL rotor, which the, the part that spins right there, and um, it says on the what? Cut, cut it. So it has the M. So it has the MGL rotor right here, the the, the part that spins, and uh, that that stands for Magnum Light, which I'm reading right here. The MGL rotor for up to 48% less rotational inertia than traditional ro rotor construction for a quick response in critical situations. So I'm guessing that. That has something to do. Uh, that goes right along with the with the gears, the six to one ratio. Another new, another unique thing about this reel is it's used for both fresh and salt water. For you uh, salt lifers out there, you know who you are. I see you in your Chevys out there. But you ain't got this though. You see the Chevy? You raised it up. I respect it. It also has a good, also has good crank retrieval. So with every crank of the handle, one full, one full turn of the, of the handle retrieves 35 inches of line. So that's uh, that's pretty that's pretty good, especially when you you make a cast and you catch a fish, and you know when it starts running at you, it's hard to catch up to that fish, you know. And uh, that uh, this, this right here pretty much gives you an, an advantage. In that particular moment, if you know, you know what I'm saying. Oh shit! I grabbed it while you're swimming. Catch that one. Maybe. Let's see. Oh, there's no one right there. Oh look, they went they went to it. I got him. Oh no. That dirty dog. I'm telling you it's a dog over there. Let's catch it. What if my drag is too loose? Let's tighten it up. Yeah, do it again. There's one right over there again. But also, I'm on the grass. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Didn't want it. Gotta hook them. Oh. 
There's one way over there. Let's see if I can get him. Where'd it go? There he is. There's turtles in the world. Oh, what was that? That's a big ass bass. Oh my gosh. That thing's a beast. Oh, he's swimming to me. Don't go in there. I might have to go get it. Go get him. Get over here. Get in here. Oh. Look at that. Oh, my shoes. These were the new ones. It's okay. It's worth it. Jesus. It's worth it. Oh, my God. Dude. Look, at that. Look at that bass, man. This thing is huge. I did not. I didn't even see it over there until I until I threw it, huh? Look at that bass, man! <laughs> that thing's huge. Now hold it up this way so that way they can see. Look at it. See how heavy, see how heavy it is. I don't know. I don't have any scale or nothing. I can't even check it up like that. Yeah. <laughs> that thing's massive. Compared to your leg, it's like to your knee. That's past your knee. I got it. Oh, this is a big ass bass, man. I didn't even see it over there. Somewhere over there. Come on. And wore out, wore out. Did you see that one over there? No. Look at that, man. And overall, overall, this reel right here, I believe this is an absolute unit of a reel. <clears throat> overall, performance-wise, man, uh, as you just saw, man, they handled it handled well in that situation. And honestly, it, it, it and honestly, this reel came in clutch at that situation, man. I've had I've had plenty of reels in the past that uh, that have failed me in situations like that so this right here i believe that this reel uh definitely came in clutch on that day man that was and i was just testing this reel out man i know i didn't really use that much uh there wasn't that much commentary while i was fishing which i was that was when i was just going out there and you no know, testing the reel i was not expecting to catch that fish on it on or catch anything honestly but uh that was an amazing that was an amazing day man all thanks to this reel right here i believe so man because when i was cat because when i was casting and that was a pretty far cast that i needed uh to get it was probably like i don't know maybe maybe 20 meters away from me man that was a that was a good distance but with this reel right here man with the uh with the long stroke spool that it's uh that's built into it that allowed me to make that farther cast without even trying, man. If I if I needed to, I could have went maybe almost all the way. I could have cleared cleared that uh all the way, or I could have you know casted all the way to the other side of that pond if I needed to. 
with this with this uh reel and uh it definitely came in clutch man um like i said back to it it was about 230 dollars and i believe that it is worth every penny of it honestly to believe um and i mean that that's uh that's about it if you have any more questions about this reel um in particular just ask me just ask and then uh you know i'll uh i'll do some research and i'll get back with you man but i appreciate you for watching and until next time man go ahead like subscribe man to the ftb channel man we got some some pretty good adventures coming up i have a i have a good feeling about this year man and until next time away